Good morning, Sir Will. Today is Monday, April 30th, day two on your timetable. I'm Corey Bergeron, and I should probably be on the audio mixer right now. Well, Corey, with the new broadcasting groups comes new positions for just about everyone, and a shuffled broadcast schedule. It's going to take a little bit of time to adapt. Shall uh, we? I, I don't really know how this works. All right, well, uh, you read this one, and then we just go from there. Gotcha. If you're planning on taking a Reach Ahead or Makeup course during this summer, registration starts tomorrow, May 1st. Please see your guidance counselor for more for your registration form. Sounds well done, Corey. It's all good. Want to spend the day at Petrie Island? Learn about the importance of water in the developing world? Have an amazing day with your friends and raise money to help free the children adopt a village in Sierra Leone? Then get a Walk for Water pledge form from outside room 2024, the library, student services, or the office. I have to say I went last year and I had a blast. Never has a school day turned out to be so much fun. Definitely check this one out, Sir Will. Now, on a completely different note, please pay close attention to this next clip that deals with a very important subject. Sup, Princess? What are you doing your book report on again? Um, Memoirs of a Geisha? Is oh, it? I thought you were doing it on Moby Dick. Mm. Very funny, guys. No, actually, it's pretty sad. I just have a question. Does your dad know how gay you are? Everyone knows how gay he is. Question answered. Oh, you cool yeah. The things you see happening online have real consequences. Will you stand up or stand by? There's a couple sporting events taking place today. The junior girls soccer team visits Nepean High School at 1.30, so be sure to wish them luck. Also, the junior boys rugby team will be playing Colonel By at 2 p.m., and the girls rugby team faces St. Pete's at 4.15. Both of those games are on home turf, so be sure to show your support. You forgot one there. What? Oh, right. The girls softball team has a practice today and Thursday after school. That was close. Nice recovery, man. Now, if you're a techie, you may already know this, but it is especially important for anyone looking to upgrade their current mobile phone to something a little nicer, say, that elusive iPhone 5. Well, you may be waiting a little longer than you thought for that elusive phone. In accordance with Apple's predictable releasing cycle, the Worldwide Developers Conference of 2012 probably won't reveal the iPhone 5, since those huge mobile releases are often scheduled for October. But if this one is indeed going to be a more software-oriented presentation, I am super excited. For you graduating students, such as yours truly, there is a grad info session being held in the library tomorrow, second period. Speaking of grads, with prom on the way, there are a couple of safety concerns that need to be addressed. Please pay close attention. Ever since I was a little girl, I've dreamed of my senior prom, having the most amazing day, and I did until I made a poor decision. A decision that changed the rest of my life and the decision that ended my best friend's life. I learned the hard way that prawns and alcohol don't mix and I have to deal with the consequences of getting into that car every single day. Everyone makes mistakes. Don't let this be your last one. Some very powerful testimonies there, Sir Will. If you're going to be participating in Food Fest, there are rehearsals being held in the cafeteria after school every day, this, every day this week leading up to that big event on Thursday. And that is all for your announcements today, Sir Will. Stay classy, Sir Will.